Hi Sagittarius and welcome to Intimate Goddess Tarot. My name is Inez and today I'm doing your weekly love reading. <coughs> Excuse me. And please keep in mind that these are general love readings so it cannot nor will not resonate with all of you. So if it doesn't apply, then let it fly. If it does apply, then I would love to read your comments down below. Also, if you would like to get a personal reading, you can contact me at IntimateGoddessTarot at gmail.com. And also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. So let's get your reading started. Please tell me about Sagittarius and Love from March 4th through the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in Love from March 4th through the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in Love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in Love from March 14th. I mean, I'm sorry, from March 4th through the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in Love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th, 2020. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love from March 4th to the 14th. Please tell me about Sagittarius in love. There we go. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Six of Wands. And let's see what we got here. Okay, so we have the Page of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. The Ten of Swords and the Ace of Wands. The Six of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. Okay. So, some of you guys could be dealing with a fire sign, Sag, Leo, Aries, another Sag. Or you could be dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Or air, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, and water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So you guys could be dealing with anybody here. So it looks like here, a someone was with the Page of Pentacles here. This someone was making an offering, but I guess it wasn't enough for you, or it could just be an apology, and you have walked away. You brought this to an ending, and you want a new beginning, due to the fact that somebody was crumbing you, and you left. You're leaving. Yeah, this came to an end and now you want a new start. So you're leaving all these choppy waters behind due to somebody was crumbing you. You're leaving it all behind. You're moving on. Let's find out about the Six of Pentacles, okay? Please tell me more about this. Not the Six of Pentacles. The Page of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Page of Pentacles. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Please give more information on the Page of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Page of Pentacles. Please give more information on the Page of Pentacles. Please give more information. Okay. Okay, so it looks like here we have Judgment. We have the Ten of Wands. And the Two of Wands in reverse. So this was a burden for you. It was too much of a burden. Looks like somebody here wants to come in and make an apology to you. But this whole entire situation was too much of a burden for you. This person had no sense of direction. They had no sense of direction at all. 
and they want to come back in but you're like no it's too much of a burden and you ended up leaving with the eight of cups here please get more information on the eight of cups please get more information on the eight of cups some of you guys could have been dealing with an aquarius please get more information on the eight of cups please get more information on the eight of cups please get more information on the eight of cups why is the eight of cups here please get more information on the eight of cups you walked through, we have the star and we have the eight of wands. So you guys walked away. It could have been from a, an Aquarius and somebody here wants to communicate. Like I said, they want to communicate because they want a second chance. Now keep in mind, this can go vice versa. It could either be you or it could be the other person. Now I'm picking up on their energy. So if you need to flip it, then by all means, go right ahead and flip it. And also this applies to men just as well not just to female or men as well okay so it looks like somebody here does want to communicate but they want to communicate to apologize but they have a, they want a second chance but this person it was too much of a burden for you it was too much of a burden for you this person had no sense of direction and healing needs to take place you needed some healing because this all came to an end let's find out about the ten of swords Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Please get more information on the Ten of Swords. Okay. So you guys could have been dealing with a player. Because we have the Knight of Wands. We have the Four Cups in Reverse. And we have the Chariot. Moving on. So some of you guys could have been dealing with a Cancer just as, as well. So... You could have been dealing with a player and they missed the opportunity here with you. Opportunity was missed here because you're moving on. You're moving on. This person was a player and there wasn't offering you what you wanted. And you're moving on because you want a new start. Please get more information with the Ace of Wands. Please get more information on the Ace of Wands. Please get more information on the Ace of Wands. Please get more information for the Ace of Wands. Please get more information on the Ace of Wands. Please get more information for the Ace of Wands. Please get more information for the Ace of Wands. Please get more information on the Ace of Wands. Please get more information for the Ace of Wands. Okay. So you're no longer holding back. You're moving on because we have. So for the Ace of Wands, we have the Wheel of Fortune. A new beginning is starting for you. A whole entire new chapter is starting for you. Some of you guys could be dealing with an Aquarius or a Leo, Scorpio, or a Taurus. We have the Strength card here in reverse. So no longer holding back. And we have the Ace of Swords here. So somebody wants to have a conversation with you. Somebody wants to talk. And truth is going to come to you. Somebody wants to talk. Let me get one more on the Ace of Swords. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. Look at you walking away again. Please give me more information on the Ace of Wands. I mean, you leaving this situation. We got the Eight of Cups here. So, you're leaving. You want a new start. You getting on your chariot, your motorcycle. And you're leaving. You're determined to leave. We got the Eight of Cups in here twice. This is you leaving. You're no longer going to be holding back. You're moving on. With the Ace of Swords here, whatever this truth is, you're still moving on. Because you, you're still moving on. doesn't matter what the truth is. You're still moving on because this person could have been, this person was crumbing you. You was dealing with a player here. And they missed out on the opportunity. They missed out on the opportunity, but now they want to come back and apologize. But you know what? It's too late. It's too late already. You had your chance and you blew it. 
and now you're no longer going to be holding back you're going to speak your truth and you're going to move on you're going to keep it moving you're going to keep it moving let's find out about the six of pentacles please get more information on the six of pentacles please get more information on the six of pentacles why is the six of pentacles here please get more information on the six of pentacles why is the six of pentacles here please get more information on the six of pentacles Please get more information on this. There we go. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. So now we have the Knight of Swords. We have the Lovers in Reverse. And the Two of Swords in Reverse. You guys had a falling out. Yeah. You guys had a falling out. You made a decision. You guys, you made a decision. You guys had a falling out and you left. Let me get more. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. That was my hand. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information on the Six of Pentacles. Please get more information. Okay. We have the Queen of Swords in reverse, and we have the Ten of Cups in reverse, just as well. So, if this was a family, you guys were not getting along, you guys had a falling out. And you made a decision, you leaving, and somebody here is pissed off, somebody here is mad. Somebody here is mad. This person was crumbing you. This person here was, they was crumbing you, but you already made a decision. And there's nothing this person can tell you to get you to change your mind because you leave it. I mean, we have one, two, three, four. We have four cards that indicate you leaving. You don't want to hear what this person got to say. They had their chance and they blew it. And now it's too late now because you're moving on. You're no longer holding back. You're going to tell this person what, the truth in their face. You're going to tell them what you got to say. And plus, with the Queen of Swords right here in reverse, they're pissed off. So when, when, this, Queen of, when, this, when this Queen of Swords speaks her mind, she speaks the truth. She speaks the truth. And she'll tell you the truth in your face. And it's going to come across, it could come across kind of brutal, harsh, rude, but it's the truth. And that's what, she, and that's what you're doing. You're no longer holding back. You're going to speak, you're going to say what you got to say, and you're going to keep it moving. Because you don't want nothing to do with this person. You don't. You're moving on. You're done with this person. You're completely done. Let's find out about the Six of Swords. Please get more information on the Six of Swords. Why is the Six of Swords here? Please get more information on the Six of Swords. Please give more information on the Six of Swords. Please give more information on the Six of Swords. Why is the Six of Swords here? Please give more information on the Six of Swords. Please give more information on the Six of Swords. Okay. You're moving on to a new love. You're moving on to a new love. If I could pick up these cards, it would be nice. We have the Two of Cups. So there's someone else here. And we have the Knight of Cups. So this is new love. You have someone new coming in that's a soulmate for you. And that's where you're going towards. You're going towards them. And you got the Four of Cups in reverse. So you don't have to worry about this person holding back from you. The Seven of Swords in reverse. So there's no... There ain't gonna be, you don't have to deal with nobody lying and cheating on you. You don't have to deal with any of that. You're leaving all of this behind because you don't want nothing to do with it. You're done with this. You don't you don't care what this person got to say. You're just going to say what you got to say and you're going to keep it moving because there is someone else that's coming in who is a soulmate. Either you know this person or you don't know this person. But this person sees you as a soulmate and you're moving towards them. And you don't have to worry about this person you know, holding back from, you know, holding back, not opening up to you emotionally 
or financially, you don't have to worry about that, or you don't have to worry about this person lying. I mean, most likely this person is come is gonna come clean by telling you that they actually want to be with you. Because with the Knight of Cups here and the Seven of Swords in reverse, this is somebody coming clean, telling you that they want to be with you. Telling you that they that they're actually in love with you. This is somebody here. So you might know this person, you may not know this person, but either way, somebody here is going to come clean and they're going to express their feelings to you with the four pentacles in reverse. They're opening up and they're expressing this, their feelings to you because this person actually sees you as a soulmate with the two of cups here. With the two of cups, they see you as a soulmate. So you have someone new coming in. There's someone new here that's coming in and you're leaving all of this behind because you ain't got time for it nor you're going to make time for it. You're tired of it. You tired of it? It was too much of a burden for you? Uh-uh. You're leaving it all behind. This person didn't have a sense of direction on what they wanted. And now they want to come back in with an apology, uh, wanting a second chance. But you know what? Not happening. Sorry, not happening. You missed your chance. You had your chance and you blew it. You missed it. I'm hauling ass. I'm getting the hell up out of here. I ain't got time for this shit, nor am, I, nor am I gonna make any time for it. I'm done. I am done. This is a wrap. I'm done. You're gonna speak your truth, and you're gonna keep it moving. You're gonna go right ahead and keep it moving, speak your truth, and keep it moving. Because you don't want nothing to do with this person. You've made up your mind already. There's someone else that's coming in that wants to be with you and that you're going to gain a victory with. With a six of, with a six of uh, wands here at the bottom of the deck, you're going to win with this person. It's a victory because with this person, you're actually going to be happy with them. With this person, you're going to see them as a soulmate and they're going to see you as a soulmate. So you guys will be happy. So this is a really good reading. This is a really good reading, Sag. A really good reading because you're moving on. Leaving all this shit behind. You're tired of it. You got somebody else new coming in that you're moving towards. Some of you guys are ready with this person. Some of you guys are not. But are you gonna, you getting ready to start a new chapter in your life. A new chapter is starting now. A new chapter. Some of you guys may be dealing with a... Uh, well, yeah, like I said, you guys could be dealing with anybody. You could be dealing with a Gemini just as well. A Leo. Let's see. And I said Aquarius already. And who else? Yeah, so you guys could be dealing with anybody. This could be anybody here. But the fact is that you got somebody new. You have a you you starting a new chapter in your life. Okay, so Let's get your guidance message here. Please give me a guidance message for Sagittarius. 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 That was way too many cards that came out. Please give me a guidance message for Sagittarius. Please give me a guidance message for Sagittarius. Gratitude. Pray for what you need, but be grateful for what you have already received. Okay, so this is all I have for you guys. I will see you guys again for your weeklies. You guys take care, be safe, and uh, stay cool. Bye, Sag.